Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. So today I have an unboxing for you guys. I have been dying to do this video but I've had to wait until the actual item has arrived and this is an unboxing of my secret cosplay. Yay! I am so excited to um, unbox slash unpack this. Um, I have been waiting for this to come through the mail for a couple of days now. The designer, Black Sheep Latex, who made this outfit, messaged me probably about three days ago saying it's ready. This is what it looks like and I was absolutely amazed by how it came out. And um, She said that she was going to send it and I was literally like waiting by the letterbox like is that it? Is that it? And the day it actually decided to come, I was at work. So I came home from work and there was a ticket through the door that said, this is at your local post office. And I couldn't collect it to the day after, which was awful because I just wanted to go and get it. Um, but yeah, I got it and picked it up today and I had to film this video straight away. When I upload this video, I would have actually already shot this cosplay and released it online. But yeah, this is my secret cosplay that I've now been planning for about, well, it feels like forever. But I would say I reached out to Black Sheep Latex probably uh, roughly around about four or five months ago and said, hey, would you be interested in doing this cosplay with me? Um, it would be a custom piece. She said, yeah, draw me up kind of the idea that you're going for and I'll work off that. So I sketched out a rough idea of what I wanted, sent it over to her and she sketched out her own idea of it and I fell in love instantly. And then we came to an agreement of the little tweaks here and there that I wanted, etc. And we came to this final design. I have not opened it yet. I've not even peeked inside. As you can see, it's still sealed. I haven't touched it. So yeah, I'm super excited to get into it. And um, so yeah, I'm just going to get straight into the video, guys. So if you want to see the unboxing of my secret cosplay, then keep on watching. So I have literally been dying to do this. So I'm just going to tear straight into it. <laughs> um, I don't know what I'm going to grab out first. I know that there is an extra little something in here um, for another cosplay as well. Let's see what piece we can get. Oh, I can see all the colours. It's so cute. Um, I'm not even going to tell you guys what the secret cosplay is. I'm just going to pull out each piece. Oh my god, so cute. I can't even handle how cute this is. Um, so yeah, I'm going to reveal this and tell you what my secret cosplay is. So my secret cosplay that I'm doing in latex is Princess Peach. Oh my god, this is so cute. This is like a bright bubblegum pink it's even prettier in person the color oh my god this is so cute so she made me like a body um like a body all in one suit and um, it's a bit like my harley i like the bodies i feel very secure in them at conventions and that it's got a zip um all the way down i like it to come quite far down because then i find it quite easy to get in and out of um when you need to go to the toilet and also after a long day at cons or at photo shoots it's you get quite hot and sticky in it and it can be a bit of an issue to get in and out of it so it's really nice when the zip always comes quite low which she always does for me which is really nice of her so yeah i asked for super ruffled sleeves which she has done they are absolutely adorable oh my god this is amazing so yeah it's got the ruffled sleeves on each side and then it kind of goes like tighter here so they're really gonna be like really puffy basically how princess peach's dress is at the top it's super super puffy hers does have like a high neck but i'll show you the other item that i kind of swapped out to still create that kind of high neck with hers and um, i will show you in a minute as well i have got the gem to stick on here to go with my tiara um as well but that's the main piece oh god i love it so much so yeah let's move into the next piece i'll put that down gently when you have a latex piece please always make sure that you handle it with care because they are very 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 delicate pieces um so this is the next piece and this is like a hot hot pink oh my god oh my god it isn't is it 
Oh, it's kind of got like an iridescent glitter to it. I didn't even know this. Oh, I don't know if you can see that, but it's got kind of like a, it's not gonna focus on it, but it's kind of got like a sheen, like a glitter sheen on it. But this is um, a little choker to obviously represent the ruffles at the top of Princess Peach's dress because um, she has like a ruffle here at the top of her dress but I didn't want that I just wanted kind of like a nod to her original look Um, I obviously wanted to jazz it up the way I wanted it but that is so cute this latex is absolutely gorgeous Um, yeah this is the next piece made in the same latex colour oh my god this is like everything i just want to wear this all the time <laughs> this is a little pink latex skirt and that sits like on my waist and it's kind of like the puffs that um princess peach has on the side of her dress but i had it go all the way around um just so it kind of brings that color to go around the back of me as well to break up the other latex piece but i'll show you those two colors against each other so this is that really cute bubblegum pink and then that's that really hot shiny pink next to it the contrast in that is absolutely beautiful oh, I, I love this cosplay already and i haven't even got it all on together yet um this is the last and final piece to this cosplay. Oh, these are perfect. These are so perfect. Princess Peach's gloves. And I asked her to do these in kind of like a fingerless style. And it's got the little shape at the top like hers has. Oh, I don't even know if I can try these on. These are going to be so difficult to get on without any, like, latex lubricant to get them on. Oh, no, I can get them on. Yeah, I can just get them on. Because you always have to kind of either put, like, talcum powder on or, like, latex lube to get yourself in and out of latex because it can be quite an issue normally. Um, I've never had latex gloves before, so I was a little bit nervous. But they're actually really easy surprisingly easy to get on and off and that's what they look like at the top they're adorable and they're quite roomy here which is quite nice because I do tend to swell at conventions quite a lot so I'll be able to pull this up so it's nice and super tight for the convention but yeah I absolutely adore this i'm so excited i really want to try it on but it's super hot in the uk at the moment so by the time this video is up i will link in the description box below to my instagram and my facebook because i will have pictures up on there of this cosplay i would have already shot it so i will have um all the images up on there so you can go and check out and see what it looks like um but I have to say, her craftsmanship and her work is absolutely beautiful. I mean, this is to die for. Mm, I think I could like try this around my waist. I'm like praying everything fits. I mean, she normally gets my measurements perfect. Um, let's just try this on. Oh yeah, that does fit. I'll just show you like where it kind of sits. Please ignore the like clothes that I've got on around it and obviously you won't be able to see my tattoos because I'll have that um, pink piece underneath. But that's gorgeous. And that fits like a dream as well. Really nice. I'm so excited to now shoot this. I'm shooting it in a couple of days. Um, I'll show you my tiara and the gem that goes on the front as well just so you get the full full effect so I bought this off line I can link where I got the tiara and the gem from as well because she sent me some stuff in this package as well so I could stick this gem 
on the front just here. Oh, so, so cute. I absolutely adore Princess Peach. Um, I've only ever seen one of the latex cosplay of Princess Peach and I don't think many people really cosplay Princess Peach if I'm honest. I've not seen that many floating about on the internet. And then this is my crown. All this together is just, I'm so excited to do it. So yeah, moving on from this Princess Peach excitement, she did make me one other piece um, as well. That of course is Harley. Um, what else would you expect from me if I'm gonna get a piece from Black Sheep Latex? Of course, I am gonna throw a little Harley piece in there as well. Um, so I have shown on here my last latex piece that I got from her it was like a skirt and like a top, gloves and the collar. Um, but I'm going to be wearing this to a convention in September and it's a kids convention so I can't wear the skirt because it's a little bit short. Um, so I messaged her and said can you also just make me some Harley pants as well to go with my top so I can interchange it. I could always wear this underneath the skirt and then if it gets too hot because it's two pieces of latex layered up, I can take the skirt off and there's something underneath. And these are them. So I have got the diamonds on the front and the back. These are adorable um i'm really excited that i got these i was kind of a bit worried with the skirt like i said um it was coming up really really short and i thought oh i can't really wear this in september and it is the one that i really want to wear but these are so so perfect yay i'm not gonna try these on because like i said it's really hot and sticky in england and i'm filming this late at night so it's really like humid and horrible and when you're trying latex on like this is the worst time to try it on when you're a bit sticky and clammy because it just it just sticks to you like glue so i will try all of this on um i will do a video probably around next week i'll upload it of a vlog of me doing the shoot with princess peach so you get to see like behind the scenes of me getting ready and also shooting i'm going to shoot it in a studio and i'm also going to shoot it outside i think in like a woods to get some really nice headshots against like the greenery um but yeah, I'm going to leave this video here today. I am so excited with everything I have got. I will link Black Sheep Latex in the description box below. If you have any questions about her work, don't hesitate to message me on here. I will answer your questions. Helen is absolutely amazing at what she does. If you have any queries or you have a design that you want in your head, don't like don't think you can't message her with ideas she will fulfill any latex dream that you have um she's made full gowns in latex she has made cat suits like full cat suits she even makes like underwear sets her stuff's incredible i'm so happy that i have got on a base now with her like a base level of where i can approach her with any cosplay idea i have and she will just take it on and make it much more better than what i imagined or what i originally sketched out so yeah thanks for watching guys if you could give this video a like that would be amazing also subscribe to my channel my subscribers are growing and it means absolute world to me i can't believe how well my youtube is going and how greatly responded i am on here with all of my followers so yeah, thanks for watching guys and I'll see you next time. Bye!